okay let's go really quick and do a hard reset on this lenovo tablet let's go and uh, the purpose is to remove any password pattern or pin locking the screen of, the, of your tablet and if your screen is frozen also just a long press the power key for up to 20 seconds and make sure the tablet is off and at least 60 percent of battery and charge and then you're gonna use um you're gonna press and hold for up to five to eight seconds uh, the volume up volume down and the power key at the same time okay and then um you wanna um, after a little bit the tablet will vibrate and release immediately those three um, buttons okay and uh, make sure that um uh, make sure that you know your google account associated with the tablet because after the factory reset you may have to verify google okay and um <clears throat> and if you have any external memory card make sure to remove it to save some files stored in that tablet as well okay so you're going to press um, volume up down and power at the same time volume up down and power at the same time and i like i said um, as soon as the tablet vibrates release these three keys okay ready let's go in volume up and down and power okay release these three keys and um and in just in case when you press these buttons and you see a message at the bottom of the screen saying meta mode i have another video showing how to exit um that message or how to remove that message as well okay so just uh i have a playlist on this uh, about lenovo the Lenovo tablet M8 MHD uh, tech support. Okay, using volume down, you want to highlight and select wipe data factor reset. So basically, you press one, two, three, four, five times, and then wipe data factor reset is been selected. Now press the power key, it's going to be your enter, and press one, one time volume down to select factory data reset and um <clears throat> just to confirm that we went through that everything is going to be deleted on the internal memory tablet like pictures videos contacts downloaded applications uh, everything is going to be deleted that's why it's important to remove external memory card so you can save files and store in the um, micro sd okay and if you are ready and you agree with this just press the power key to confirm your factory data reset and uh, when the tablet finish to um, wipe data uh, the reboot system node is highlighted automatically so just press the power key to reboot your uh, tablet and then I, it's going to take a few um, some five to eight minutes for the tab tablet to work properly and take you to the main screen where you have to register your language and um, everything else to continue and get to the home screen of your device just in case that your uh, lenovo um, get freezed one more time on the logo uh, it happens sometimes just press the power key for up to 20 seconds to power off the tablet or the screen and um, and do the hard reset process one more time you can repeat the process for up to 20 times i for comments in my video saying that some of the users uh, has um, do the same or repeat the process for up to 20 times and finally that way they get the, the tablet to work properly and take them to the initial setup screen where they just pull up the tablet and get to the home screen so if this is your case um, uh, just uh, power off the tablet and start over again with the same process okay um, okay so um i i want to do a, a different video um on what to do in case that your skin get frozen so it take longer than like eight minutes that means as if something is wrong as, but there, there is another way also different other steps that you can take when you're trying to unfreeze your screen so if that is your case just uh, search my other tutorial and so now we are here on the initial setup screen 
um, you can touch here and you can choose um, these other languages uh, that are available for your tablet and uh, or select your favorite language and touch start okay leave every single um, Lenovo terms and conditions and touch next to uh, get to the next step next step is registering a Wi-Fi account for your tablet uh, since this tablet has already been registered with a Google account uh, you have to choose a Wi-Fi account if you see something down here saying uh, skip skip this step then that will be awesome because you don't have to verify Google but in this case it's asking me to verify Google so I want to register a Wi-Fi account to continue and now I want to I give some time for the tablet uh, right here I can see that my tablet is already uh, connected with a Wi-Fi account now the uh, tablet is getting ready to um, <clears throat> for the system to verify with uh, Google accordingly with the serial number serial number of the tablet okay so just give a moment and okay great and now it's asking me if I have another device I would like to transfer my um, data to this uh, new tablet just go to the next button follow the steps uh, for now I'm gonna choose don't copy okay and I'm gonna get the following message checking info verify password pattern or pin since I have forgotten this uh, password but now I'm gonna use my Google account to uh, verify instead okay so I'm gonna touch verify Google instead and I'm now gonna enter my email address. This device was reset to continue sign in with a Google account that was previously synced on this device. Okay, so I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna put my email address. Okay, now choose next to continue. I'm gonna ask my uh, Google account password. Okay, so now make sure that this is the name of your account and your email address. Now enter the password associated with this email address. Okay, touch next to continue. Uh, the previous Google account on this device has been verified. You can add this email address back to this device or you can use a new account. If you want to use a new account instead of this email account and then uh, use new account. I want to add previous account. So I'm going to keep the same account. So I'm going to choose add previous account. Okay. And when you choose a new account, you can uh, like go to, um, we can uh, open a new uh, Gmail uh, address. Or if you have any other um, Gmail address, you can use the existing one that is something that um, you haven't used on this tablet okay so now google services i highly recommend you to leave as show on the screen um, it's very very important so your results with google will be accurate i'll continue setup continue okay uh, google assistant Okay, Google Assistant, I'm going to say no thanks. You can set up this after when you get to the uh, main screen. I'm going to touch more. I'm going to skip voice recognition. Uh, add a card. I'm going to skip this one with GPay. Um, I'm going to no thanks as well. I don't have anything else. Uh, no, not now. You can set up your lock screen. Once you get to the home screen, I'm going to go to settings and set up a password, parent, or pin. And please take a note, write it down somewhere safe so you can remember. Okay, so now just getting ready your tablet and I'll take a few minutes. And just this is basically the last step, such as um, follow any other uh, steps and choose yes or no. Thanks so much for choosing my video. Let me know if you have any questions. Please subscribe to the channel. Please smash the like button and share my video to your social um, 
media or page for your friends and uh, if you have any other questions please uh, write it down in the comment section and I'll be happy to get back with you as soon as possible to answer any questions that you may have okay thanks so much